Hey everyone, Victor Salazar here from the Rewind Radio Show, which airs every Tuesday, 7 to 10 p.m. Central Standard Time on Ustream.tv. That's my shameless plug for the weekly radio show. So on to our DJ tip for today. I want to talk about customer service. Um, customer service is very important in all aspects of your business, and I think everybody should make sure that their level of customer service is at their very best every single time you make contact with any client or potential client um, let's start off with probably the phone we should probably all answer the phone in three rings or less it would be a good idea to be prompt when you answer your phone and when you answer your phone answer politely by saying good afternoon good morning good evening um, this is so-and-so of X promotions how can I help you or just if you don't want to give your production in that's too much um, this is so and so how can I help you it would probably be a good idea to give uh, say your name of your company um, just so you keep drilling the name and the brand into your clients or potential clients heads and that's what they're gonna remember um, if you can't answer your phone make sure that your voicemail contains a nice message asking the client to leave their name number nature of call um, or how, whatever you guys want to put down in your voicemail, but make sure it's a nice voicemail that, that uh, uh, the clients can feel comfortable leaving a message um, with and so on and so forth. After the voicemail is left, make sure that you guys call your clients back promptly. Don't take too long to call back because that's time that you're giving them to call somebody else to make contact and um, hire somebody else and then you're out of a gig. Um, emails uh, probably would be the same way make sure you guys have a signature line on your emails you know having your name telephone number web address email link again on the bottom uh, maybe title if you are owner proprietor um, DJ assistant director whatever it is make sure you have that on there um, answer your, your emails uh, quickly as well don't sit on that too long try to answer right away if you can um, once you make contact with your client, make sure when meeting them that you are dressed appropriately and are clean, so, <laughs> so on and so forth. I mean, you guys know uh, what to do. Um, try to get there 20 minutes before they arrive or before the set time. Chances are that they're going to do the same thing to make sure that you are a prompt person. So it would be a good surprise if you guys get there early. Before they do, if not, even if they get they're early it, it makes you look good when you um, when you get there early anyways so now the day of the event after you get all your music together you get uh, all the requests the do not playlist the must playlist so on and so forth um, all the little ceremonies for whatever type of event have passed and now it's the party time and people are coming up to you to, to request songs make sure you guys are polite if you're by yourself and, and saying um, I'll try to play your request um, or I'm sorry I was told I can't play that song for whatever reason um, you guys can have a little notepad there with a nice marker they can write down their their request there um, especially that works pretty good if you're by yourself because um, it, it they're not bothering you in the sense of if you're trying to put two songs together for those guys that that don't use software uh, to do the mixing uh, and you guys want to manually you know combine the songs together or you're getting all your whatever it is that you're doing it keeps you focused on what you're doing and, and then uh, but if you get a chance try to talk to and make contact with these people as well um, it's very important that you guys are polite and exhibit good customer service levels because you never know when you're gonna have a client it can be a potential client who's gonna have a wedding in a few months and they're amazed by your awesome light show and, and uh, the way you guys do your up lighting or however you set up your system it's gonna impress somebody else they're gonna be like we want the same look at our wedding and you don't want to be the one because you were probably rude to the person and they're, they're, you know, the, the question is going to be, why did you hire that guy? That guy was rude to me. Um, I'm not going to hire him for mine, and you shouldn't have hired him for yours. And then it's going to trickle down, and it's just the word's going to go around. So 
always try to be nice. You never know when, when that's going to happen. Um, the perfect example is the other day, uh, Brian S. Red put up a video about Big Daddy who met this wealthy prince or something in Vegas. They played up in the suite and got a $20,000 tip. Now the guy is like traveling all over the place uh, playing music for this guy. And I mean, you just never know. I mean, it just could open up uh, a lot of avenues for you. And I mean, especially if you're doing what you love doing. I mean, it's just like who wouldn't love to get an extra $20,000? And, and say if you're any, at an event and somebody asks you to do a, an after hours and then, you know, you go take all the gear, blah, 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 and then you get $20,000 just, you know, for doing that extra step. I mean, wow, you just never know. So uh, it's very important just to basically be nice <laughs> at all the events. So um, that's it for this tip. So please leave your comments below. Um, if, there's, if anybody else has any ideas, um, that we can add to this. Um, I probably rambled off a little bit uh, trying to get all the ideas all at once. Perhaps I should have written stuff down, but um, what better way of starting a dialogue than if there's something that I miss, please make a video, post it, do a response video log, or just leave your comments below. And for all of those that have not done all, uh, done so already, sorry, please uh, subscribe to the videos if you guys like them. Let me know what you guys think. Rate them. I'm a big boy. I can take it. If anybody has questions that they would like me to answer, I would love to do it in my own little way. And I'll give you my opinion of what I think works for me. It may not necessarily work for you, but it works for me and it might work for somebody else. So... Uh, with that being said, I hope everybody has a great week and take care. Hope to see you guys soon at a DJ convention near you or uh, here on YouTube. Take care, guys. Have a great week.